Queen, you're a liar. Why didn't you tell me Queen was pregnant? I told you. Everyone knows but me. I'm the only fool who went out to let you kiss me thinking you actually have feelings for me. I, I do. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I haven't been totally honest with you, but that's different than mine. Maybe it's not that much different. But look, I, I need to get a music scholarship so I can go to college, so I can get a good job, so I can take care of my kid and... Nice support, dude. What do I have to bros before O's? You've got a baby on the way, bro. You haven't done spit to take care of it. Like, do you do any different? Damn straight. How? Nobody's hiring. Still at your Xbox. Rob a bank. Go on, rob it on this joint. Whatever it takes. All I ever hear is you whining and crying about how hard this is on you. What about her? Dude, you are so out of line. You don't know what I'm dealing with. All I know is that you're a punk who doesn't deserve to have Quinn as his girlfriend. You're a punk. Alright, see, I can become this girl right now. Um, this this outfit's really expensive, but I can't afford it. So it's not in the avatar editor in this game. So I gotta, you know, put it on my... I can figure this out. Uh, let me just... Do that. So I put that there. Oh, God! It's all... Stuff in the hot tub. Just eat that up. You were stupid enough to buy it. Hey, 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 hey. I am so sorry. You did this to me. You told Coach Sylvester about my summer surgery. You have a surgery when you get your appendix out. You got a boob job. You got a surgery. You can't hate me. Well, sure I can, unless you got yourself knocked up again, slut. Stop violence. special for over a year now but frankly i haven't walked the walk i mean we have got a lot of talent here and i'm gonna highlight it Do something. look i'm all for pumping up the team making everyone feel special but that's for practice you don't take the star quarterback out before the big game yeah, easy to say when you're the star quarterback this isn't just about me Other than all of you i see that clearly now it's britney bitch guys we're not doing britney spears and that's that Mr. Shoot, you are letting your own personal issues get in the way of something that we are all telling you we really want to do. I mean, this club regularly pays tribute to pop culture, and Britney Spears is pop culture. To suggest otherwise is regrettable. I'm done talking about this. Jeez, let loose a little, would you? Stop being so freaking uptight all the time. Asian, that's racist. Totally racist. Oh. <laughs> Did you get that? You saw it here first. Did you know there's a forum on my blog that's begging you to stop rapping? Wait, the kids don't like when I rap? When will you be clever to accept the fact that people hate you? I think mean, you're nothing but a glorified no karaoke club designed to make the inventors of auto two millions of dollars! What, Miss Bossy Pants? Enough. I've worked just as hard as you, and I'm just as good as you. You know, you always end up stealing the spotlight. Mercedes, you honestly think you're as strong of a balladeer as I am? 
belts are kind of my thing. Okay, um, Rachel, why don't you let Mercedes give it a try? So how much do we have now? Well, this one dollar, we have one dollar. This is ridiculous. Well, maybe if we put a jelly bean or something on top, would sell more. Are you an idiot? How am I supposed to trust you to take care of our baby when you can't even figure out how to sell a damn cupcake? Stop attacking me. I'm sick of it. I don't want to have a confrontation. Don't play stupid with me, Stubbles. I'm having this baby, and you need to back off. I'm asking you as nicely as I possibly can. Leave him alone. You're right. I I've helped you not because it's the right thing to do, but because I had romantic ulterior motives. But just so we're clear, you're the one who's cheating. Excuse me? I have a good authority. Drizzle. Drizzle. Yeah, yeah, because you know how awesome it is when it's just drizzling outside, but it, it's not really raining, so it smells like rain, but you don't need an umbrella to go outside. Are you alive? What? We're not naming our baby Drizzle. We're not naming our baby anything. It is your test. Push me. 
Oh, uh, see, I, I sort of do. I'm from a part of town called Lima Heights Adjacent. You know where that is, Poppin' Fresh? It's on the wrong side of the tracks. with someone else that there's one other person in your life that can provide for you things that I'm supposed to provide it's just too much for me to take and Santana knows that she's taking advantage of it to break us up no everybody thinks she's a bad person but she's not god Brittany why are you so stupid you were the only person in this will have never called me happy happy it's for Bray wait you know, there's only one person in this world that you care about, and that's yourself. You have no... I'm not finished! Oh. You're not a little girl anymore, Quinn. How long do you plan on playing the victim card? You know, since day one, you've done nothing but sabotage the same glee club that has been there for you over and over again. When you got pregnant, when your parents kicked you out, you know, Mercedes even let you live in her house, and I don't recall ever hearing so much as a thank you. So now you're a train wreck. Well, congratulations. I know all about the hot sauce and the book and everything else you planted here. You think they were just going to come here and find those things and they hand my baby over to you? She's my baby. You have no idea what it means to be a mother. It's not about whose body she comes out of. It's about accepting the fact that you don't matter anymore. That your feelings and that your life and that your body, they all come second to making sure that that child is happy and safe. So why you gave yours up for money? At least I did what I thought was best for my baby. You were just a cash whore. Hey, Santana, why don't you just come out of the closet? You know, I think I know why you're so good at tearing everybody else down. It's because you're constantly tearing yourself down because you can't admit to everybody that you're in love with Brittany and she might not love you back. That must hurt not be able to admit to everyone how you really feel. You know what I think you are? Coward. I'll see you at the back. I'm sure this is special enough for you. I've been saving it for a hotel for us. Some place nice, like a like a Marriott or something. If we wait a couple of weeks, I can probably... No, I, I can't wait a couple of weeks. I have to get this done before opening night. Get this done? I, I, I can't play a girl who has a sexual awakening if I'm not woken up myself. So you're doing this so you can act better? No, no, I'm doing this because I love you. And so that I can act better. But that's my business, okay? It has nothing to do with you, so... Uh, my ankle hurts. Push through it. I, I don't feel good. You're fine. No, I'm not. Look, Mercedes, I want you to be the best you can be, okay? Did you even practice this? Well, stop picking on me. You're always singling me out, making me look bad. That's crazy. No, you're crazy for not letting me shine. Where's Rachel, huh? I don't see her here being a part of the team. Rachel practices it. No one asked you, Finn. Everyone knows that Rachel is your favorite. That's not That's true. true. You, you give that skinny Geronimo wearing... I just can't, and that feeling that Sue was talking about in there, of being tethered to someone, I, I just, I don't feel that way about you. But you do with her. No. We're not breaking up. I can handle your confusion with Rachel until you get over it. We're going to stay together, and next year we'll be prom king and queen. And just stop it. Okay? I don't want that. Just want you. Please say you love me back. Please. Of course I love you. I do. And I would totally be with you if it weren't for Artie. Artie? I love him too. I don't want to hurt him. That's not right. I can't break up with him. Yes, you can. He's just a stupid boy. But it wouldn't be right. Cheat on you. How could you do this to me? It was a mistake. Maybe we should go to another counseling session with Miss Pillsbury. You can't have couples counseling if you're not a couple. You're breaking up with me. What you did was really bad, Rachel. And you knew how sensitive I'd be about this after what happened with Quinn. You said you'd never break up with me. I never thought you'd make me feel like this. Considering how much
much you care about the holiday, I figured I'd make an exception. The bearer of this note is entitled to one song of Rachel Berry's choosing sung to him or her with love. At least it's not a kitten. Come sit. I, I don't think so. I know what you're trying to do. And it's not going to work. Not letting me apologize is I've let you apologize plenty. And I know that Christmas is supposed to be about forgiveness, but I'm not ready to forgive you, so please stop trying to... Sven. And can I just say, not worth a buck. I would, however, pay $100 to jiggle one of his man boobs. Do you ever get tired of tearing other people down? No, not really. Because you always just seem to be meddling in everybody else's business. No, oh, please. You guys love me. I keep it real, and I'm hilarious. Actually, you're just a bitch. Oh, oh, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm sorry, you've just got eyes for my man. Okay, first of all, I'm not your man. And Finn is right. All you ever do is insult us. Three weeks ago, you said you were disappointed that I didn't have a lizard baby. I used to be really close, and I really miss being your friend. Still waiting for the question. Did I do something wrong? No, I don't know. Did you? All I know is you blew me off. To be with stubbles, my cripple pants. It's fine. It's your loss. Because now I get the chance to write an awesome heterosexual song about Sam that we're going to sing at Rachel's. Wait, you're still eating Sam? But you told me you were in love with me. I honestly don't know what I was thinking. Oh. But can you stop staring at me? I can't. Sorry, I just realized that song might be the national anthem from whatever country you're from. That's really offensive. You know, I was really humbled when your three club made my sister's field goal so very touching. In fact, I was so moved that I have spent the entire year being nothing but kind to you. Today's only the second day of school. You have no right. Not gonna work out. Well, thank you for being honest with me, Quinn, and, and I'm happy for you and Finn, but don't go and try to rewrite history, okay? It was real between us. He chose me over you. And how long did that last for? Why are you being so mean? Do you want to know how the story plays out? I get Finn. You get heartbroken. You read it's Blaine Anderson, right? Right. I need another coffee. I don't like you. Fun. I don't like you either. I don't like the way you talk to my boyfriend. I don't like your smirky little meerkat face. I don't like your obnoxious CW hair. I'm on to you. Let's get a few things straight. Blaine's too good for you. New Directions is a joke. And one of us has a hard luck case of the gay face and it ain't me. Odds are by the end of the school year, I'll have Blaine and a Nationals trophy. And you'll have khakis and a lima bean apron. Everyone has secrets, Santana. They're called secrets for a reason. I want you to leave this house. I don't ever want to see you again. Oh, well, you, Bro, you, you don't now. I'm the same person I was a minute ago. You made your choice. Now I have made mine. Why? It's selfish of you.